Well, hello, and welcome once again to Stuff and Things Plays Fallout 4. I'm standing in the midst of a mute fruit patch, I guess. I've been trying to do a little bit of farming here in the main sanctuary settlement, trying to get some crops going. Got a little bit of corn, a little bit of mute fruit, got some razor grain over here, some potatoes. Um, trying to deal with the build mechanics, doing some fencing and stuff like that. It's kind of frustrating. It's not the easiest thing in the world to do. Um, but I've been fiddling around, started maybe making a, a little building here on this plot of land. I don't know. We'll see. It's going okay, but I was just fiddling around with that. You haven't missed much. And you know what? I wanted to point out I was having trouble figuring some things out. If you actually press start, you go down to help. Well, there's a lot of information in here. And if you go all the way down to the end, there are lots of things about the workshop modes, some menu, settlement, happiness, power workers. So that helped quite a bit, just finding some of that stuff out. Um, I'm still not looking anything up online. That's something that you guys need to pay attention to, or not pay attention to, but bear in mind, if you're watching these videos and you're irritated by things that I don't know, I am purposefully not looking up anything about this game. I want to find it all out by myself. So I know some of you guys try to leave comments to be helpful, um, and I appreciate that, but at the same to by the same token... But that doesn't make any sense. At the same time, I'm purposefully avoiding information about the game. I just want to experience it, immerse myself in it, and figure, figure things out. But you know what, gang? We've been fiddling around with all these build mechanics a lot lately, and it's been enjoyable, at least to me. I don't know if it might be horribly boring What's to up? you. Hey, shut up. But I think it's time for us to go out and cause a little bit of mayhem. Do a little bit of damage, don't you think? Let's go kick some ass. So let's look at the map here. Or actually, we'll look at our data. I had this fire support proceed to Cambridge Police Station. So there was this military frequency AF-95 that I picked up, and it was while I was around the Lexington area. So I think we'll go back to Lexington. We'll see if we can pick up this radio station, and we will proceed to the police station. We are supposed to provide fire support for somebody. I'm assuming it's the Brotherhood of Steel. For those of you who don't know, the Brotherhood of Steel is a faction within the Fallout games. They are devoted to to conserving uh, technology from before the nuclear war um, to the service of mankind. They can be kind of insular, though, kind of distrustful of outsiders. But I'm, I'm assuming that's who these people are that I'm supposed to help. So if we go to Lexington, um, I think it was around here. I actually cleared the Lexington apartments. That's another thing I've done, but that was just a couple rooms, so you didn't really miss much there. And here we are, and now it's getting dark, which I'm not a huge fan of. So actually, let's let's enter these apartments. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Come on. It's time to just sit in a chair for 12 hours. There we go. Whoa, what? I don't like weird noises. Uh, there were lots of mines here before. I'm assuming, since I already cleared this, they're not going to reappear. Hopefully. Mines, tripwires, booby traps, and the like. Alright, here we go. Ooh, here's the naked raiders. Sorry, ladies. <laughs> uh, here we go. We will sit. Whoa! <laughs> I keep jumping when I don't mean to jump. Now we will wait. It is 8.36. We will wait for 11 hours. It'll be 7.36 in the morning for those of you who are not good at math. And that will be the perfect time for us to go a-killin'. Hopefully this mission will be kind of interesting. You never know. Hey, dog meat, let's go. All right, here we go. We'll just go out this way. By the way, I did secure a laser pistol, which I have now, I guess, turned into a laser rifle because I put a stock on it. Let's take a look at that. Uh, where is it? Yeah, short boosted laser rifle. Only has 30 damage, but, you know, I thought I, I figured it was time for me to use an energy weapon every once in a while. I hadn't found a laser, actually, throughout the game so far. Um, 30 damage, fire rate's pretty good, accuracy's pretty good. I don't have science yet, that perk, so I can't do much in terms of modification with these sorts of weapons. But, anyway, we'll see how it works. Let's just jump down here, maybe jump down here. Ugh. 
All right, so in which direction? I think I already have the station tuned in. Let's see. Uh, let's do this. We'll tune that in so we'll know once we get close enough, we'll pick up that radio signal. And that will allow us to find where we need to go. Where was, where was it that we needed to go? Maybe around this way. No. We're just going to wander aimlessly for a while until we figure it out. Aha. I think, yeah, this is familiar. This is where I kept getting blown up by the mines. This way... I think I've... S yep, I've seen this bus station before. Yep, yep, yep. We're going in the right direction. Ooh, I hear gunfire in the distance. Ooh, what's going on? What's going on over here? Uh-oh, let's take a look. Uh, where is that? Holy mother! Oh, there's some ghouls! Holy crap! Are they attacking raiders? <laughs> Goodbye. Goodbye. Well, uh, I guess we could maybe get involved with that, perhaps. Let's take a look. Oh, ghoulies! Oh, oh, we found the military frequency. Let's see if it'll... Automated message. Aha! This is Scribe Halen of Reconnaissance Squad Gladius. Scribe to Halen. In transmission range. Authorization ARCS, Ferrum 9-5. Our unit has sustained casualties, and we're running low on supplies. We're requesting support or feedback from our position at Cambridge Police Station. Uh-oh, here they come. Uh, so you could hear that. It was Scribe oh. Halen. <laughs> Mr. Sumner. Ooh, he burnt. Ugh. Mr. Donahue. I don't know why these ghouls all have names. Um, yeah, first shots with the laser, not bad. So you guys could hear that dinner fork. You could hear that little uh, radio frequency that, oh, here we go again. Basically saying that they're at a police station, the Cambridge Police Station. Let's turn that off now, because we don't need to keep hearing that. And they need some fire support. So we will go there eventually. Um, for now, oh yeah, see, down below. On the bottom of our little radar, you can see a police badge icon, so I'm assuming that is the police station. Let's get a little stim pack here. Um, I don't know what the heck was going on with these ghoulies. We've got Miss Rosa. And they all have cutlery. Interesting. Let's take a look at this. The police station can wait. Oh, wow. So they killed some raiders. Hey. Uh, we'll just take all this crap. I did figure out how to scrap raider leather armor, or just leather armor in general. I can throw it down um, when I'm in one of my settlements and then scrap it through the workshop menu, but it still seems like you should be able to do that through just the workshop itself when you're in the transfer mode, but I don't know. Uh, let's see, we'll grab all this. Weigh myself down. Mrs. Parker, why do, they, why do these ghouls have names? This is intriguing quite intriguing. That's the one I sniped from a distance, I believe. Let's see here. This is some sort of little stow. Jangles the moon monkey. <laughs> Alrighty. Hey, come here. Hey, dog meat. Come here. Hey. Wait there. Come on. Okay, now I want you to uh, uh, uh. How you doing, buddy? Fetch. Hey, boy. Think you can find something for me? Uh, items. See if there's any good stuff nearby, boy. <laughs> go, dog meat, go! Now oh, you little useless bastard. Alright, let's see what we've got in here. We've got some pipe pistols. I'll take one of those. We've got a can of potato crisps. 
Duffel bag. Oh, 10 millimeter. I'm always looking for 10, 10 millimeter rounds. Still my favorite pistol is my 10 millimeter. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. What else? What else? There's, I really hope there's some sort of information as to why all these ghouls are running around and why they were all named. I have never seen named ghouls before. It's quite strange. Ooh, what's that? Medex. Cigarette. All right, well, I guess that's just one of those little things. There just happened to be some ghouls here. They were all good friends, living a life of ease in this little store. And uh, some raiders came along, tried to kill him. Ghouls went in, get, got a little crazy, got a little angry. And that's it. We've got the Cambridge Police Station right over there. Um, before we go there... I am going to get into my inventory. We're going to go to aid. We're going to do some right away. And I want to get my health all the way up, if possible. There we go. We'll do a quick save. All right. Hey, dog meat. You ready to fuck some shit up? Ooh, there's another red rocket over yonder. Lots of icons here that I have yet to explore. But first thing is first, the Cambridge Police Station. I'm assuming this is Cambridge. And look at that. Look at that. We've got somebody. Who do we have here? Well, it's another ghoul. And that's another ghoul. And that's a dead body hanging from a chain. That ghoul is eating something? Wow. <laughs> Lovely. Ah. Oh, here they come. Ooh, nice. Am I already doing it? <laughs> Am I already helping these people? Whoever they were. Oh, look at that. Who is that? Is that a raider? A dead raider? Alright, let's go. Let's figure this out. Heading towards the police station. Oh! Who's this? Somebody's here. Nothing there now. Man, you picked the wrong fight. Where, where, where? Where? Oh! You will die. Bam! Your head's gone, baby. It's just gone. Where'd she go? Did she completely get incinerated? Oh, sweetie, where are you? Where is she? Where is her dead body, dog meat? Well, that's weird. Um, here's another red rocket. What's the deal with this? Let's let's see if we can. No, this isn't gonna be a location. Apparently. I don't want to get sidetracked into all this, though. This is this is a huge other can of worms that could could be opened. I want to head to this police station and see what's up. We can explore all this other area later. I don't have a lot of energy cells here for this laser. So, I don't know. We might have to switch this out eventually. Hello, ghoul. They like cutlery. Okay, I'm hearing some... Oh, oh. There we go. Feral ghoul. We've got a ghoul. He's trying to get down here, I think. And I'm hearing some gunfire going on. There's another ghoul there. Here he comes. Come on, ghoul. Take your time. Welcome to your doom. Mm. The bam There you go. Excellent. Oh, shit. God damn frickin' Die, ah, you sons of bitches! Stupid! Okay, there we go. Frickin' mines all the time, man. Getting 
rads from his corpse or something? Ugh, boy. Oh, it's a little mongrel. Alright, let's figure out what's going on here. College Square. Okay, that's a location. Raider military grade duct tape. Don't mind if I do. Uh oh, dog meat found an enemy. Where, buddy? Where is he? Where? Where, where, where? Okay, lead on. Lead on, dog meat. Lead on. Where is he, boy? Where, boy? Where? Quite the battle going on around here. Aha! Oh, boy. Oh, wait a minute. Hello, Mr. Ghoul. I don't like that. It takes two shots to almost get their health completely down, and then I have to waste another one to finally get the rent. Okay. Oh, Jesus! I hate that! God, I freaking hate ghouls. Oh, you sons of bitches! Just quit falling down until I shoot you. Ah, oh, frick, I'm out of, out of ammo. Sons of bitches. I hate ghouls! I hate them! Oh my god. Loading up on all this crappy raider armor, too. Hey, bottle caps. Okay. There's another ghoul around here, I'm assuming. Oh, what the hell? Oh, that's just a... <laughs> A pile of steaming ash after I blew it away with my... Ooh, what, what was that? Wooden block ID something? I need to actually pay attention to what I'm grabbing out of here. Are you alive, ghoul? No. Cambridge Police Station. Still haven't reached it. This is just... Oh, my... Okay. Dog me. Come here. Dog me. Hold position. Come here. Okay. Inventory apparel. You will take that. You will take those. Those. That, 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 that. These. Those. Ooh, I found a pompadour wig, by the way. <laughs> Pretty cool. My god, I've already picked up a lot of crap. Ooh, yellow flight helmet. That's cool. I'll give him some weapons as well. Where are my weapons? There we go. Uh, we that. Compensated heavy pipe pistol. Interesting. Some knuckles. There we go. Alright. There's still... Okay, there's a ghoul right there. There's still a lot to explore in this area, but we're trying to head to this police station. I think we're getting close here. Oh, I told him to stay. Come on. Hey. Let's go. Over here. Here we go. Police station. We are here. What's happening? Ghouls! There are ghouls! Aha! That looks like a Brotherhood of Steel guy. Let me get this off your back for you, baby. Hey, I was killing that thing. Hello? Oh. Oh, okay. Oh, dog meat. Look at that. Alright, this is getting confusing. Let's get out of this zoomed in mode here. Who's attacking? 
Jeez, Louise. <laughs> oh. Man, I'm using up all my 10 millimeter. I don't have any action points. Alrighty. I guess that's the end of that. Let's take all their spoons and bobby pins and duct tape and eight balls and all the other crap that they carry with them for some strange reason. Fancy hairbrush. Lovely. Oven mitt. <laughs> oh, why are things blowing up? fusion cell. I could use that. Nice. I will talk to you soon, Brotherhood person. Right now, I am looting ghoul corpses. Because that is what I do. Lots of bobby pins. Lovely. Ooh, do I get this? Ooh, yes. Oh! Things are blowing up. Take some of that. Oh, railway spikes. <laughs> Alright. Uh, what else we got around here? Ammo is good. I could use more ammo. Get out of my way, dog meat. Hello, corpses. Baseball. Ooh, it's a Brotherhood Knight. Steel hollow tag, plastic knight. Ooh, a laser rifle. Is this the same kind of. Oh, no, 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 no. That's not a musket. That's a laser rifle. Let's see what that's like. Um. Ooh. Okay, well, it's basically what I've already got. A little bit longer stock. Missiles. The Brotherhood people usually have the more advanced weapons because they're into preserving technology. So that's always cool. You can usually find lots of fusion cells and things. Of course, this is a different game. I'm going based upon what I had experienced in Fallout 3 and such. Hello, Paladin Dance. This is cool. We have made contact with the Brotherhood. I am stealing all their equipment. But it's not in red. Hey, Knight. Um, Rise. Try anything, and I'll cut you down. All right, I just saved your ass, my friend. Excuse me, Scribe Halen. Thanks for lending us a hand. You're quite well welcome. Welcome. All right, where is this paladin, dude? Where'd he go? Paladin dance. Oh. <laughs> Hello. Excuse me. We appreciate the assistance, civilian. You're welcome. What's your business here? Uh, my business? Test exterminator. I heard you had a feral problem. Evading my questions is a surefire way of getting yourself ejected from the compound. Oh, Are yeah? You local settlement? Why the questions? Do all these questions really matter? After all, I help you fight those ferals. This would be much easier for both of us if you cooperate. Now, where are you from? Oh, fine. I'm from Sanctuary Hills, on the other side of Concord. I've seen the location on our maps, but I've never visited the area myself. There isn't much over there for us to collect. If I appear suspicious, it's because our mission here has been difficult. Since the moment we arrived in the Commonwealth, we've been constantly under fire. If you want to continue pitching in, we could use an extra gun on our side. Hmm. I want to help, but I don't like the secrecy. Who are you, really? Very well. I'm Paladin Dance, Very Brotherhood well. of Steel. Over there is Scribe Halen and Knight Reese. We're on recon duty, but I'm down a man and our supplies are running low. I've been trying to send a distress call to my superiors, but the signal's too weak to reach them. Sir, if I may. Proceed, Halen. I've modified the radio tower on the roof of the police station, but I'm afraid it just isn't enough. What we need is something that will boost the signal. Mm. Our target is ArcJet Systems, and it contains the technology we need. The deep range transmitter. Mm -hmm. we infiltrate the facility, secure the transmitter, and bring it back here. So, what do you say? Are you willing to lend the Brotherhood of Steel a hand? Oh, maybe. Who are the Brotherhood of Steel? Our order seeks to understand the nature of technology, mm -hmm. its power, its meaning to us as humans. And we fight to secure that power from those who would abuse it. How did mankind abuse technology? Before the Great War. Science and technology became more of a burden than a benefit. The atom bomb, 
Bioengineered plagues and FEV are clear examples of the horrors that technological advancement had wrought. We're here to make sure that never happens again. <laughs> oh, right. Let me be sarcastic This again. is just a fancy way of saying that you're looting everything you can get your hands on. Looting implies that we're attempting to benefit ourselves. That couldn't be further from the truth. So, what do you say? Will you help us? Oh, okay, you big guy. You won me over. No time to waste. Let's get moving. Outstanding. All right, so now what the hell do I do? Halen, take Reese inside and bind his wounds. Yes, sir. Reese, once you're on your feet, I want you to make certain the perimeter is secure. I'm on it. All right, civilian. It's time to prove your worth. Uh -oh. Head into the police station and resupply yourself. Then let me know when you're ready to begin. Let's move out, people. Alright, big guy. Okay. Let's go. Yeah, yeah, I'm coming. Ooh, leveled up. Completed fire support. Um if I run in and resupply myself, does that mean that I have to immediately Okay, we started call to arms, speak to pilot and dance. Uh alright, well let's go in here. We'll take a look around. See what I can grasp in my greedy little mitts. And then I don't know, we've been going for a while here, so we might end the episode once I have resupplied. Can I talk to you now? Hey there. Why are you standing around here like there's nothing to do? Paladin Dance is waiting for you. Why are you such a jerk? Jerk. I'm resupplying with drinking glasses. 38. I want 10 millimeter, gang. I'll take these stim packs, though. Don't mind if I do. Ugh! Inactive so distress pulser. I don't know. Your prognosis looks pretty grim. Might be more humane to just take you out back and shoot you. Whoa! Fusion core. Just quit squirming so I can get these bandages on. Wow. How's security looking? Sounds like Scribe, to to whatever her name is, and pretty solid. Paladin, who's him or what's us have something going on? Yeah. Scribe Halen. Scribe Halen. If that happens, Sorry about the other guys. long enough to worry about it. Why are you so Why nice? are you cutting me so much slack? I, uh, I joined the Brotherhood not too long ago. I used to be like you, wandering alone. So I know what it feels like when every single person you bump into sticks a gun in your face. Look, it may not seem like it, but Dance is a good man. He's just all soldier. Protocol is his bread and butter. And Reese? Well. Let's just say he's as hard-headed as a Mr. Gutsy. But you know what? I trust both of them with my life. Because they're good people. And that's hard to come by nowadays. Laying it on pretty thick, Halen. Scribe Halen. You better get a move on. All right. It's not a good idea to keep Paladin Dance waiting. Let me finish my looting here. Is this, oh, oh, Gladys personal terminal. Let's get into this. What's going on what here? Recon Squad Gladius, Pallet and Dance Personal Logs, Gladius Personnel Status. Knight Sergeant does. Deceased. Knight Rees. Active. Really? I thought he was dead. Keen. Deceased. Brack. Deceased. Warwick. Deceased. Aelin. Active. You guys have not been doing well, have you? Let's see his personal logs. We will start with... Uh, where was it? 87? 10? Wait a minute. These are in... Oh, no. Those are in the right order. There we go. After several months, my squad has just crossed the border and entered the Commonwealth. We've chosen to immediately search the boss region with the intention of finding a secure building to use as our recon headquarters. Soon after, my squad was ambushed by raiders, Night Keen's power armor was destroyed, and we lost some of our supplies. Fortunately, we were able to repel the attack and continue our mission. We've discovered a secure building in Cambridge that appears to be a former police station. We were able to clear the building and recover a good deal of supplies and ammunition. Free war caches inside, according to Scrap Halo. This location is structurally sound and highly defensible. I've decided to blah 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 blah. Doodle doo, Corvega factory, possible site containing valuable pre war. We've initiated a sweep and rooms. I've had Davis' site service discovered being held by a large force of raiders. I gave the go ahead and we attempted a breach. As we approached, our squad was hit with gunfire. Knight Warwick was wounded, so I decided to fall back to Cambridge during our retreat. Knight Warwick stopped on a landmine, scrape Halen, attempted to retreat, and. Ha! Losers! 
I successfully assaulted the Corvega assembly plant by myself. What else? It's been two days, blah, blah, blah. Sad to do, doodly dee. Warwick's dead. Scribe Halen, blah, blah, blah. Doodly do. Authorized her to judge that over to some king killers. Wow. I'd like to commend Scribe Halen for her efforts in keeping Warwick alive and for following my final orders without question. These guys suck. We sustained another casualty today at grid reference A113. This area contains the ruins of Boston International Airport. Ooh, and Fort Strong. The airport was almost completely abandoned, but Fort Strong turned out to be infested by super mutants. Uh-oh. We were hoping to resupply at the armory there, but Knight Sergeant Dawes was killed. This is the second location I've had to order a retreat from since we arrived, and the third member of my team to die. I recommend a complete bombardment of this location in the future. <laughs> Do do do. Scribe Halen has been picking up unusual energy readings on her instrument. She claims that they are an extreme high band spectrum frequency, which makes it highly unlikely to be pre war and origin. The readings are also highly sporadic. Only appearing for a very short amount of time in very specific locations, the decay in these signals is severe and they seem to disappear off Halen's instruments after several hours. We don't have the equipment necessary to track these readings, so we're attempting to use triangulation to discover their point of origin. Last log. We've been attempting to contact Scabbard. With the energy reading, Halen is collected, but the police station's high-gain antenna was damaged by a super mutant rocket attack, and we can't transmit the data. Halen is attempting to repair the antenna, but she isn't certain that we have the parts we need at this time. Well, it's just a comedy of errors for you guys. Orders. Proceed to the area designated as the Commonwealth to perform a standard long-range recon operation, LRRO. Report any unusual activity using standard long-range communications to Scabbard. Extraction time undetermined. Paladin dance. Alrighty. If reinforcements are coming, they sure are taking their sweet time. Hey, if Paladin dance says they're coming, then they're coming. We just need to hold out a while longer. I don't know, Halen. We've lost half our squad already. Even with this new guy helping, I hope we can stay alive long enough for them to get here. We'll make it, big guy. We'll make it. What? You some kind of hot shot? <laughs> yes, I do. Why are you so angry with me? I'm not angry. I'm just letting you know where you stand. You're hired help, and that's all there is to it. Ooh. Is there any way to earn your respect? Oh, I don't what we care. Get told. Keep your head down and your mouth shut. Now, why don't you run off and see if Top needs you to do anything else? Ooh. Man, oh man. That was a hell of a fight, wasn't it? Watch those barrels get blown up. Somebody's gonna get himself a knuckle sandwich. Ooh, a personal lock. <laughs> Has anyone ever told you? Uh, where is that? That's in miscellaneous. Let's play the hollow tape. Scribe Halen, personal log entry, 324A. I'm starting to wonder if joining the Brotherhood of Steel was a good choice. I originally signed up seeking protection and comradeship, but I'm worried that I've traded away a bit of my humanity in the process. The Brotherhood's message of hope for the future is idealistic and noble, but their methods leave a lot to be desired. The leadership seems especially misguided. Instead of diplomacy, they wield violent confrontation to exert control. Despite all that, I've been successfully avoiding the fighting by following the career path of the field scribe. Paladin dances. I suppose only time will tell how no, no, long I can stand the sight of spilled blood over my own moral fiber. Hmm. Interesting. Um. And meanwhile, she has to put up with sexual harassment Why from this bastard. Like to do. Shut up! Paladin dances waiting for you. I don't like him. Do 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 do. Looking for stuff in the Cambridge Police Station. Get out of my way, dog meat. Move, dog meat. Okay. Ugh. Always oh, underfoot, my friend. I want this bucket. Uh, that just goes out to Cambridge. Out on the roof, I'm assuming this is where their antenna is that needs to be repaired. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Anything of interest? Nope. Alrighty. 
Oh, wait a minute. Ooh, look at this. Looks like a vertebrate could easily land here on this helipad. I wonder if that's going to play into a future mission. All right, we're just going to finish doing a sweep of this police station, grasp up everything we can. And before I take a little or have a little talk to uh, Paladin Dance, I might go back to Sanctuary and unload all my crap. Because if we're doing another mission, we're obviously going to be picking up many more spoils. So it'd be nice to have a clear inventory before that happens. Let's just take another little look around here. What do we got? What do we got? Stuff, stuff. We need stuff. Good, free stuff. Ooh, expert. Excellent. I put a uh, point in my lock picking perk recently, so now I, I can pick expert locks. Which comes in quite handy. Ooh, that was close. Come on. Ah, ah, ah. Back to a little bit. Ooh, so close. Ha, ah, ha, ah, ah, ha, ah. ha. This time for sure. Damn it! Almost there. Ah. Come on, man. Ugh, for God's sakes. <sighs> Ooh, a stealth boy. Ooh, for those of you who don't know, this will make me invisible for a brief amount of time. Very cool. Can always use a stealth boy. Yes, yes. Oh. Watch out, doggy. Watch out, buddy. Let me go. Let me through. Patrolman sunglasses. Awesome. I'll level up later. Cool. I've got my cop sunglasses now. Alright, we're just about done looking through all this crap. Take a broken lamp. We'll need that. One last office to look through. Desk fan. Operation Winter's End. Let's take a listen to that. Oops, what am I doing? Inventory, miscellaneous. Uh, Operation Winter's End. Hello, team. Captain Widmark here. Welcome to the task force. Operation Winter's End starts now with you. Together, we will knock Eddie Winter off his throne and dump his sorry ass in a 2,000 volt easy chair. It should come as a surprise to no one that our operations in Boston have been, in a word, compromised. Winter has eyes everywhere, even the BPD. So, our brothers across the river in Cambridge have been kind enough to let us use the Cambridge Police Department as our base of operations. Let's get to work. Good hunting. Alrighty. Not sure if that has anything to do with anything. That was pre-war, obviously. Andy Winter. Some sort of crime boss, I'm assuming? Uh, bone cutter, military fatigues, more sunglasses, ooh, a visor. <laughs> well, this is just ridiculous. Suspenders and slacks. 
too much good stuff. Huh. Can't get through here. Alrighty. So this, we've explored all that, right? So now we got the basement. One last little bit of place. A little bit of place. A little bit of exploration to do. I'm trying to speak and talk, which is the same thing, and move at the same time. And sometimes it doesn't work out too well. But this is a looter's dream here. So much duct tape. And Wonder Glue, love you people. Thank you so much. A comedy Wonder Glue? Ah! I'm in heaven. Completely in heaven. This is amazing. Now what's this? Cambridge Police Station Motor Pool. What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? Uh oh, what do we got in here? Power armor station. I wonder if this is. Nah, I doubt the Cambridge Police Station will end up being a location that I can use. Yeah, buddy. More duct tape. My god, people. I know I love that. More Wonder Glue. This is so amazing. Caps. This is the best place ever. Fusion cells. Yes. Oh, yes. 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 More duct tape. Adjustable ridge. I don't really care about that. Um, now I am over and covered. Got it. Good buddy. Good buddy. Heads up. Let me give you some stuff, my friend. I'll just start giving them junk. Dogby can't carry anymore, and I am still over encumbered. Oh, no, no. All right, let's open this up, see what happens. Uh oh, there's a train, everybody. Enjoy that. All right, so we just got some stuff out here. Nothing too exciting, it looks like. Yeah, quite the defense is built up here, though. Pretty cool. Hey, stay there. Hey, I didn't say that. See if you had anything worth taking. Yeah, go do that. Wonder glue. All right, I would, I would guess that we have found everything that we need to find in this location. We have found the radio signal. We followed the radio signal to the Cambridge Police Station. We found a squad of Brotherhood of Steel members under attack by a group of feral ghouls. We read about their adventures in the Commonwealth. They have not been doing well, and now they have asked me to locate some sort of antenna booster thingamajobber. And I have said, oh yes, I will do what you asked me to do. There is one knight, Knight Rees, who is an asshole. There is Scribe Hayden, who is pretty nice. And who he is trying to have sex with. On their heads in power armor. Shut up, Rees. Oh, I don't like you. I love that sound. All right, so I think we're just going to end the episode. Oh, uh, 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 forgot something. And for now, and I think before I even talked to this little humongor here, I'm going to go back to Sanctuary, unload all my crap so I can start fresh on this mission. So next episode, we will be doing the Call to Arms. We will be speaking to Paladin Dance, and we will go to ArcJet Systems, where we hope to get our hands on a deep-range transmitter to repair the Brotherhood of Steel communications array. So pretty fun. Had a little bit of action, a little bit of enjoyable uh, ghoul crushing. I found a sweet pair of sunglasses. Actually, you know what? <laughs> just before. Just before. There we go. Sweet pair of sunglasses. I've got a sweet pompadour wig. And I think that's just fantastic. So, thank you so much for watching this edition of Stuff and Things Plays Fallout 4. I've been your good friend Bradley. You've been the audience. I'll see you later. Why are you standing around here like there's nothing to do? Paladin Dance is waiting for you.